yeah. I, I, I think I, it's, it's a worthwhile question, but also I think that um, uh, the question of open source versus proprietary is almost, it, it almost doesn't matter. Um, it's really about you know the software and the capabilities, and open source is one way to get a great set of capabilities. We happen to believe it's the best way to get uh, a set of capabilities, but uh, you're exactly right that uh, interoperability and being able to work with all different kinds of platforms. I mean, and also, I want to uh, make explicit, you know, we say open source, and a lot of people say open source is kind of code for the Linux operating system, or open source is a code word for right. an alternative to Windows. Right. There is a tremendous amount of open source out right. there, which is much more than just an operating system, right? You've got application servers, you got databases, uh, cloud platforms, and uh, I think if you look at who's moving to, as, as an example, you look at who's moving to cloud and what's happening with the data center consolidations, this using these data center consolidations as a forcing function, right. um, government is following industry and, and moving to open source platforms uh, uh, overwhelmingly. Right. Uh, they're getting off of the old proprietary systems and moving on to systems that give them, you know, could be cheaper, maybe more choice. Right. Um, maybe it's just that's where the talent is. Right. Uh, but there is... Uh, there is a strong correlation, although maybe not a causation, between this move, th these consolidations, and the adoption of open source, absolutely. Right. 